Well, the COVID-19 pandemic and supply chain nearly crippled the Cobb County Cobb Link paratransit system for thousands of disabled and elderly residents who depend on that public transportation. Only five of the 30 vehicles used for the service were actually operational. Tonight, Bill List revisits the transportation system that almost came to a grinding halt. Last May, when we first visited Cobb Link, the majority of the fleet stood idle in the parking lot. Vehicles were broken down and up to a two year wait for parts, and that was due to COVID and serious staffing shortages. And with that, chaos for Cobb residents who rely on those vehicles to get the doctor's appointments or to go grocery shopping. But now, says Cobb Link Paratransit Director Theo Letman, a dramatic turnaround. So we're back to full. A full cadre of vehicles with up to 22 vehicles now. So we have more service um, uh, being provided. We're at 97% on time performance. And the added vehicles also means Cobb is expanding its services to what it calls an on demand flex service with advanced reservations. It will be to more parts of the county. For residents who rely on Cobb Link for necessary trips, getting back to a post COVID normal is critical. We met up with one of them. For Marilyn Burnsed, it's been a year and a half of trying with her neighbors to get from Marietta to a large supermarket using Cobb Link where they could negotiate the aisles with their walkers without any problem of having to move out of the way. When we heard about this, we got on it right away. Ms. Burnsed, what if we were to tell you that it's been worked out that you're going to be able to get on the paratransit here, take it over to Austell Road where there's a covered bus stop, and you'll be taken after a year and a half of you trying to the Publix or the Kroger right where you want to go at Powder Springs and Macklin. Oh, really? That's wonderful. Oh, we're, we're so happy to hear that. We've been working and we've been patient and patience does pay off. Our next goal is to make certain that the plan to get to the larger supermarkets using Paratransit and Cobb Flex works. From Marietta, Bill Liss, 11 Alive News.